Hey YouTube, it's your boy K Bradshaw 880. Okay, um, I just figured out that the clutch, it's a CVT clutch, uh, came off of the X6 that I burned up. Uh, this is it right here. Um, I just sat it up against my uh, 212 cc engine and I see that the bra the the mount is the same size this so this can fit on there so I gutted it took out the uh, I don't know what the name of the stuff is but these are the parts scattered everywhere and it was a small where's that piece this is the original part uh, shaft that was in there that connected, you know, from the engine and turns, uh, make everything mechanical. Uh, I am in a process of boring it out, like this piece here. Uh, this was the same size as this little end here. But I grinded it out to be a uh, 3 4 inch bore. Um, and I also grinded out for the, the key spacer there. I have two more pieces to grind out. I'm in the process of doing that now and I just did the start so I can line up my edges and where is I want the key space to be. Um, this part was pretty much already three-fourths so I didn't have to bore this out but I am going to you know grind it out smooth it out in there for a perfect fit and then I have the rear piece which I also bore it out and I just have to add the key slot um once those are once I'm done with that I can pretty much reassemble it uh reassemble it to the to the to its housing uh I may need to find these things I think these are like the uh pillow beds or pillow pillow bearings I may need to find some of the same size, but, you know, we'll see. I'll let you know um, what I did with that once I get to that part. But, just wanted to give you an update. Um, someone asked me uh, what, you know, how how was I going to get the, uh, the engine to run because I have it mounted on the right side of the bike where the, sha the, the shaft is on the right side of the bike. And it turns counterclockwise. So, you know, it, of course, anyone who knows how a pocket bike transmission is run, it turns counterclockwise, and it's all it's a gear that actually pulls the chain that rotates clockwise. So, seeing that my CVT is constructed that way, okay, uh, here it is taped up here because I'm going to paint this, but this turns counterclockwise. And there's a gear inside there that it hits and turns this the right direction. So that way it can pull your wheels forward. Okay. So if you have an old pocket bike, um, you know, with the, you know, you have this setup, which most pocket bikes come with, unless you modify it yourself. But if you have this setup, then, you know, break out your tools if you're looking to put a, a 12, 212 cc engine on it, you know, if you want to go big and you want to maintain the same drive uh, system, then, hey, break out your tools, uh, gut this thing out, and set it to your specifications. Okay, so that's my update. Um, I'll, let, I'll be back with another video once I get a little further in the project, and I hope this answered your question. Um... I can't think of the name off the top of my head. I think it was Kev, Kev, Kevin or Kev something. I'm not looking at my YouTube page, obviously, because I'm recording the video. So, hopefully this answers your question. Uh, if you find out something else before I do, hey, feel free. Leave it in the comments. All right? It's your boy K Bradshaw signing out. Uh, rate, subscribe, leave comment. See you later.